Welcome back to NC Bass and today, Tuesday tournament, Lake Norman, 6.30 to 11.30, it's supposed to be cloudy all day, which is good for me. I mean, I think the, the shade lines have been a good bite, but that, that spawning bite's dying off. There's probably still a bunch of fish garden fry. I really need the sun to come out for that. I'm, I'd rather just catch them on top waters all day. Hopefully there's a good chat spawn going on. I mean, water temperature's probably around 70. It's gonna be cloudy all day. That's good for a chat spawn if I can find one. It's kind of luck for me to stumble upon it. There's, there's one spot I know where they spawn all the time. I still think I'm gonna make that run. Hopefully we can catch them on top waters. Need three good fish. Probably gonna take around eight pounds to win. Hopefully they're smashing top waters. Let's see how it goes. There we go, finally. I had to get on the main lake. And of course, he's belly hooked now. He hooks coming out. Finally had a bite though. Oh, barely got it. Little spot. Went on the main lake, on the main lake point, on the red clay. Got one. Finally, guys. It's 746. It's been an hour and 15 minutes. I've been fishing the very backs of pockets and the places I've been getting bit. These fish are just about done spawning. Just feel like I got a better chance to catch a big largemouth in the very backs. There's probably going to be spots out here in the main lake. Golly! Got it. Oh no! Missed him three times. There we go. Flip fish, man, he's not big. At all, man. I thought he was a little bigger than that. Yeah, that's what you catch on a fluke a lot of times. Oh my gosh. That feels like a good one. Decent. He's coming at me. Oh, I felt so, oh my gosh. I missed my last two bites and that's probably why. Main lake equals tiny fish. Not even paying attention. He just bit it on the pole. Come out here to main lake to catch spots and catch a decent largemouth. Get there. I'm really about to go <laughs> target largemouth. Man, I wish he wasn't so skinny. Real thin, postpone. Man, that fish would be close to three pounds if he wasn't so skinny. He's probably two still. Maybe the fluke is the way to go. Cannot get bit flipping. I got a Texas rig on. They're just not biting it. Sun's coming out more than I thought it would. Well, guys, midday update. Had to try to get some bites in the main lake. I mean, I tried my backs of the pocket starting out and then couldn't get a bite. So I went out to the main lake, got a few bites. Missed a couple of tiny ones on the fluke. I even seen them like hitting it right at the boat. I just don't think it's going to be the way to win. The sun's out more than I thought it would be. So I'm going to run back to the creeks and try to see if I can find some fish on beds. If not, there might be some fry garters back there too. I mean, I might not even get a bite back there, but I got a way better chance to find winning fish than I do out here on the main lake. Hopefully I find some big ones and catch them. Let's see how it goes. Seen his bed. Well, seen him before he even come up to it. Little guy on the bed. He 
kept just looking at it and swirling at it, but he wouldn't bite it. But finally, something in the back of the pockets. I don't want to see spots, though. I'm supposed to be looking for largemouth. No! Man! Oh my... He killed it. Maybe he'll bite again, only hooked him for a second. Man, that was like a two pounder. Ah! You're kidding me. Oh my, and there's some fish on. I was hung up and I got one on. Big and two. Oh my gosh, that's a big one. No! Oh, he's still hooked. Stay hooked, stay hooked, stay hooked. Big one, guys. I was hung up. No. Come loose, please. Is she even on there still? Yes. She's still on there somehow. Oh my gosh, I can't let her get loose though. Freaking giant. Come here, come here. Come here, come here, come here. Come here, come here. Yes! Are you kidding me, guys? Was hung up. And this fish pulled it off. I think there's a bed. Are you kidding me right there? I had all morale given up. And I pull out this giant. Literally got hung up five times in the last. Somehow. There's no time left, guys. I don't know how this fish didn't break me off because it's weak and old. Oh, I still don't even have enough to win. I mean, I got the tiny one. In. Look at that fish, guys. Oh my gosh. At the end of the day, all these bluegill beds, I don't think that fish, I think it's just a bluegill bed fish. I mean, a giant right there. Yes, that fish is four pounds probably. Are you kidding me? How did I not lose that fish? I'm so lucky this fish has just had no strength left, really. Oh my. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Had the hand liner in. I mean, I got a, a one and a half and a two. Oh my God. About lost my limit fish right there. I got a one and a half and a two pounder maybe and now a four pounder so I could actually win now fishing's been this terrible I don't know how I got that fish in do not know how just hung up and the fish took it off the unbelievable I mean I gotta go I gotta go to weigh-ins I got a big one I got a big one yeah about three and three quarters and then Two little ones. Oh, yeah. It might be a four. It should be five. It wasn't skinny. Luckiest catch of my life right here on this. I was hung up on a walkway. He pulled it off for me. Had the hand lined it in, wrapped around all the poles. If it didn't swallow the hook, I wouldn't have caught it. Oh my god.
He's close to four, and I got these tiny ones. I thought that was two pounder, but he ain't even two. Four thirty-one. Yep. Woo! Oh, yeah. The second biggest fish are weighed in. Four thirty-one and a one and a half and a one pounder. Might have seven close to it. Seven thirteen. Yes. Well, guys, somehow got the win. Nobody could really catch them today. I think six, nobody even had six pounds. I mean, it must have been a struggle for everybody. I got pure, I mean, you guys seen it. That was just pure luck. Somehow, some way, I mean, had me, I, I was snagged on the walkway. Again, I done, I've done. i already done that like six times before that today, and I was really getting frustrated. I guess that fish couldn't stand that little baton that's shaking right there. It was right near bluegill beds. You can catch some big fish on bluegill beds, and these fish are pretty much done spawning. I mean, I could not find any signs of beds, really. I seen a couple of little small ones on beds, but. Looks like they're done bedding. Bluegills are all over the beds. I mean, the broom bed bite's about to pick up. And that's usually what I do after the spawn. I mean, I hate fishing deep. Chad spawn, these fish are probably feeding at nighttime. I don't know how I got that fish in. If that fish wasn't a post spawn and tired, there's no way I would've got him in. He should've broke me off. Had me wrapped around the, the cross member and the pole. I don't know how I got that fish in. I'm lucky that it literally swallowed the hook. So it couldn't throw the hook because it was shaking its head the whole time. But it wasn't really digging. If it would have pulled, it would have popped me off because that line was stuck. Somehow got the wind. I'm pumped. I mean, pure luck, but I'll take it. I mean, sometimes you just got to get lucky. I know when the summer gets here and these fish get offshore, I'm going to struggle. So I got to enjoy that I can actually get a win now. Like, comment, and subscribe. And thanks for watching. We'll see you next time on NC Bassin.